Yes, the owner decided just hours after it happened to open up the restaurant. And I want to show you where it all started. In the parking lot here next to me, workers were inside getting ready to open up when they heard gunshots. There was a number of gunshots fired. Lake Danoon Saloon owner Philip D. Marina says everything happened without warning around 3.30 Friday afternoon. We didn't hear no yelling, no screaming, no nothing, nobody running around or anything like that. One of his employees told him to get to the parking lot quickly. When I went outside, uh, some of my employees followed and Jeremy was laying at the side of his car. D. Marinas only identifying the people killed by their first name. Jeremy was a bartender. Laying over by the dumpster was Tom, the husband of one of his servers. We saw he had a gun in his hand, and I, I carry a gun, and I had my gun out, and he was not moving either. Both were dead. Meredith DeBack yeah. lives across the street and used to work at the restaurant. She heard multiple gunshots. We kind of put two and two together, and we're like, oh my God, the, the gunshots weren't hunters, it was from the new saloon. D. Marinas says his workers are like family, and it was important to continue with the evening as planned. We figured we're going to open. We have a, a lot of reservations because we have entertainment tonight, and we're not going to disappoint the public over this. And Muskego police say they are investigating. As for the restaurant, they plan on being open tomorrow as well. In Muskego, Ben Hutchison, WISN 12 News.